Now our body is covered in proprioceptors and the proprioceptors give information to the brain about the body's position in space. Sounds a bit weird, but that's basically the definition. Um, so constantly you know, relaying this information and um, part of that proprioception are sort of two important components called muscle spindles and the Golgi tendon organs. So our muscle spindles are uh, these spindles that wrap around the outside of the muscle. Um, so if you imagine my bicep, imagine a big sort of like a coiled spring wrapped around the muscle and that will detect the length of the muscle. So when my muscle lengthens, the spindles, or like at the coiled spring, get stretched, and that will uh, then sense that the, the muscle's being stretched. Now they're in place as a, um, like a safety mechanism, because if my muscle spindles get stretched very quickly, or rapidly, then it will trigger something called the stretch reflex where it will then cause my muscle to contract very quickly. And it's to protect the muscle. So if there's if any risk of the muscle getting torn or damaged, that muscle spindle will cause the muscle to contract and, and stop it from stretching so much. So that's our muscle spindles. And if you remember that, that associated with that, is, with that is the stretch reflex. I've sometimes as well heard it referred to as the myotatic reflex, which is the same thing, stretch reflex, myotatic reflex. And then we've also got our Golgi tendon organs. So the GTO, Golgi tendon organs, and they're responsible for detecting muscle tension. So when our muscles know a lot of tension, so if we go back to my bicep, if I was lifting a really, really heavy weight, if there was any danger of that muscle tearing under that immense weight, the Golgi tendon organ could trigger uh, my, well, disengage my bicep. So my bicep relaxes to avoid it tearing. So main role of that, again, is to detect muscle tension and to disengage the muscle if there's any risk of, of the muscle tearing.